Now, look, I know you get lots of uh, recommendations to watch documentaries and watch things on Netflix and uh, never ending stream of them. But there is one in particular that you just have to watch. It came out last week. Uh, the left tried to ban it, tried to get it off the airwaves. It's a fantastic documentary. Let me tell you more about it. So Daily Wire is uh, Ben Shapiro, Candace Owens, Matt Walsh. It's a great platform. Uh, I subscribe to it because uh, they also run a bit of a news service. comes from a conservative viewpoint and uh, it really is worth the investment. But they've just put out a documentary, uh, Matt Walsh, and uh, is the host of it. And it's entitled, What is a Woman? Uh, and look, you have to subscribe to actually watch it but it's well worth the investment. Uh, let me just show you the official trailer for it first. I have traveled all over the world for the past year asking one simple question. What is a woman? <laughs> what is a woman? What is it? What is it? I don't know. <laughs> People are laughing. Is that, is that a dumb question? <laughs> I've been asking everybody this, and almost nobody can answer it. What is a woman? What is a woman? That's a great I question. Like... If one person could tell me what a woman is. Congressman, thank you for, for being here. I think this interview is, is over. Let's turn off the cameras. I just wanted to know what is a woman. And you're not going to find out. It's not a complicated question. Well, there we are. That was a little snippet of it. Uh, and it uh, was released actually um, last week, as I said, and I did watch it. And it is it actually it's hilarious because these left wing left wing academics try to justify gender ideology, but they just can't. And they actually look foolish in the process. Uh, like, for example, this family therapist. Thinking about the modalities that I use, um, I'm definitely informed by like feminist um, family therapy um, and the idea is that um, we live in gendered worlds where there are certain imperatives that are placed on us about who we are and what we do based on how we've been gendered. From the minute I was assigned female, I was told, okay, these are the kind of clothing that you're going to wear. These are the kind of the, the type of play that you're going to engage in as a child, um, the path that maybe your life will take because of social expectation. What do, you, what do you mean by assigned female? Who, who assigns female? Yeah, so um, most times people, when they're born, um, they're assigned a gender. By the, the doctors. doctors. Yeah. Well, what, do they, what do they base that assignment on? So basically it's, it's based on genitalia. Um, so people looking at genitalia and deciding, okay, this is a, a girl or a boy. Um, and we know now that like that sex and gender are so much more than just this binary. Some women have penises, right? Some men have vaginas. Um, that that that's not how how gender works. <laughs> you can see why it's so funny. Um, and they and I mean Matt Walsh, the host, is really just trying to find the truth. He wants a definition of what is a woman. The problem is that no academic can give it, including this academic from, uh, I think, a university in California, I think it was, who actually gets quite hostile because Matt Walsh simply wants to know the, the truth. Well, I'm not even talking about social context. I'm just, I'm just trying to start by getting to the truth, you know. Yeah, I mean, I'm really uncomfortable with that language of, like, g getting to the truth again. In social why, why life, is why is that uncomfortable? Because that it sounds actually deeply transphobic to me. Um, and the if truth? you and, and if you keep probing, we're going to stop the interview. I if I, I probe about what the truth is, you keep invoking the word truth, which is condescending and rude. I'm saying how to is, you, how is the word truth condescending and rude? Why don't you tell me what your truth is, and you're walking on thirty seconds more of the ice before I get up? <laughs> what my truth? <laughs> It, it is a classic documentary. Um, and look, the, the problem for the left is that if they answer the question, what is a woman, they either expose gender ideology, uh, ideology as being foolish, or they actually uh, shoot themselves in the foot because they revert to the biological definition of what is a woman 
which then debunks gender ideology altogether. Anyway, it is well worth watch. Before I show you uh, how you can watch it, let me just show you Babylon B. As you know, I'm a big fan of Babylon B, a uh, spoof website, and they de decided to release on the same day what is a man. And if you first click on the link on YouTube, uh, you can watch it for free. It shows that it goes for about an hour and a half. And I thought, wow, that's a really long documentary to put out. But let me just show you uh, a bit of this documentary, What is a Man by Babylon B. In today's changing social landscape of gender identity and expression, traditional roles of masculinity and femininity are seemingly to blend together into a wide and diverse spectrum. This raises a peculiar question. A question we hope to answer by the end of this documentary. So join us on our journey to answer the question. What is a man? So what is a man? Uh, what, what is a man? Well, uh, a man, I, I, it's got the XY chromosome. Uh, he's got, he, he's got uh, testicles and um, a, a penis. All right, I think we got it. It's a wrap. It's packing's up. Yep, and there it is. <laughs> it's a one and a half hour documentary that has one hour and 29 minutes of credits because it only takes one minute to define what is a man. Anyway, you need to watch What is a Woman. It's a fantastic documentary. It's, it's both humorous, but it's also disturbing because you have uh, radical left-wing gender activists front up uh, with a serious face uh, and actually just show how foolish the ideology is. So uh, how do you watch it? Go to whatisawoman.com. Look, let me advertise Daily Wire. It's worth signing up to Daily Wire, even just to watch What is a Woman, but you will find that there is a whole lot more on the Daily Wire site worth watching. But if you're going to do anything this week or this weekend coming, watch the documentary What is a Woman. I highly recommend it. Mm -hmm.